good morning um good night blessing family so i'm back with another video i'm not posting this as yet but i'm just coming back with another video so my day and i'm in my hospital room i'm going to come and tell her about my deliver my labor my deliver so i'm going um the 20 the 28th wednesday night and it was a scheduled c-section that means saying uh, it was scheduled for the 20 the 20 the 28th and it was on a wednesday and uh, at 11 o'clock i come in and when i come in i was downstairs and they look about me they give me my wristband and everything so now make a walk come up the stairs now uh, they put me in the waiting room and when i was in the waiting room sit down my head water burst like well i must my dress wet up and me i said to them say don't look at my clothes and it was like your head water burst baby i was about to come on and stuff there so when i go upstairs now in the deliver room now i'm gonna get ready like, i'm gonna go up in the deliver room I lie down there in the room and then another lady come in and do another birth um the doctor said to me say she can't do me 11 o'clock because a lady just come in that was pushing out her baby so she he did he have to do that first so she, he went and he 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 do the lady first and then after that another lady come in and again so he have to do that about so he put back my my my, my 11 o'clock till five o'clock five o'clock so when i was there five o'clock so now my did they lie down it was a long period of time and i like it was a long wait but it worked the wait and my did they i'm going to five o'clock then come and then say yo we're going to take a room now we'll do um a c-session so i was like all right so i'm going there now they do spinal call i hate it to be honest um i would prefer take the epidural on my back than the spinal call because it make me feel my vomit and it make me feel like me, me are out of breath and me not like that feeling if you know say you can't help yourself. You come like me, they are dead. And God forbid, you come like me, me never have no control. But after you feel like nauseous, when you feel nauseous, and then when you come back out, you don't feel nothing from your waist, from your titty go to your foot. Your, your foot, you don't feel nothing. And then cut me, and then cut the baby, and then stitch me up and put me in one room. I went out of the room there and stuff. Then then came upstairs when we were there and me upstairs now and the doctor them all the people will come by they are amazing you have to treat me like me tell people say yes when you got a doctor treat the people them and they go to somebody jam i hospital treat them with respect and you get good treatment if i'm coming here i pay a good treatment me i get me not lie my baby and me i get good treatment you understand pay a good treatment everybody will come across me my like them um they respect me and all of that stuff there and to be honest your baby is okay me okay and um to um anything on me i have right now he have a whole pop pressure and, and he burned conscious and he mess with your walking and me tell people say when you do c-section and let them know bed um you have to get up and walk so your blood can circulate you understand if you let them in your bed it's the 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 the, the, the c-section i will get stiff by you and it'll mess with your walking and stuff there so me always tell people say anybody will do c-session no matter how painful it is and no matter how burn you get get up and walk you understand so your blood can circulate you understand so Today, the whole day today, I walk and then I burn out. And I tell the doctor, I say, I need a pill. I don't think I can continue with this stuff. And she said, At least I can be honest. And I get a medication, I get a pill, and I feel good. And I went to the bathroom like, by myself. And everything I do by myself, I take care of my baby by myself. Even though I have help, I take care of advantage. So, yeah. So, my baby is here, LT. My day at night, night now, sitting up and make a little video. I um, mean, I say, you know, thank God for the 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 the, the people um, that say KD on Facebook and YouTube. Thank you, God, for a safe deliver. I have a good deliver, even though I never like the feeling, the first feeling. And to be honest, it's good to know that you have that experience here. Yeah. And to be honest, I am done having kids. I'm happy. A boy and a girl, right there, so. so but it's a telling so that I'm my little update for right now. And if I miss nothing, I'll come back and tell them I live and deliver. But for now, I just want to come through and tell them and say, everything is good, baby girl is here. And we just all keep it moving and we we'll look out for the new blogs. Peace, love, and unity. I'm not post it tonight, you know. But just know, say, every time I reach home, I'm going to post it or 
when me feel right, me go post it. But me can make it in the hospital. You see there? Hospital, me now. Hospital room. See there? Hospital room. Right there, so. See there, me have a little fridge. Me tell you, people. People, me now my hospital room. Me get a little fridge. Me have a dining room table over this. Look. Me have a dining room. Me have a dining room table. See me, it do there. Me have a TV. Me have... Look, I have a um, clothes bin, the bathroom, you already know, you understand, I have, me have set you over there, so, so you come like a little living room, I have a set you over there, so, set you over there, so, place where people can come sit down, you see me, so, this is where it is, don't forget to like, share, and comment, I'm happy, thank God for the safe deliverance, you understand me, so, I will catch you in my next video. Don't go tell your mama, go tell your sister, go tell your matey, and go tell your side chick. Peace, love, and unity. So when I come back with another video.